Do you remember your youth when you played football in different games? Or have you come here to get some adrenaline and motivational recharging so that you can go into your favorite sport again? Today, there are such videos for you. Record goals that got into the Guinness Book of Records, balls that are just trying to hit your head, and also a couple of very touchy moments that made everyone hold their breath. But there is one little condition. Go and like it now. Done? We can get started. Grab your favorite drink and popcorn for an even better viewing experience. This isn't just another football match, but a real historical game. On the screens, you can see Stoke City play against Southampton, where goalkeeper Begovic scores from his own goal. This famous goal was listed in the Guinness Book of Records. I can't even imagine what is worse, to make an own goal or to miss the ball from the other end of the field. The Southampton goalkeeper needs to go to football school ASAP. First, please take the bat from that guy, because sooner or later, he will beat someone with it. And secondly, does this remind you of anything? This dude has better instincts than Spider-Man, and he caught the ball like he had a Winter Soldier prosthetic instead of a regular arm. He may have set a record for throwing stones on water, But this is only because my grandfather did not participate there. He is truly a professional in this field. Or he may have set a record for throwing stones on water, but if you give such a task to Indian actors and directors, believe me, the stone will overcome all four oceans and return back like a boomerang. If you are asked to explain what it's like to be an extrovert and introvert, show them the video of the first two dogs. One is chasing around the field with a stolen ball, and the other decided to take a nap from fatigue, interfering with the players. And the third dog looks like the main baseball fan. A great example to the phrase, born in a shirt. In this video, we are watching the American skier David Stratton, who for a moment deviated from the built route and fell off a cliff. During the fall, the man did not get a single injury, but only broke some equipment. Let's say thanks to the huge snowdrifts of Utah. Thank you. Huh, and here is a stone in the Adidas garden. The athlete was just warming up, and the suit was torn in the most unexpected place. Let's applaud the men who are able to contain their laughter, as well as the steel endurance of the girl who did not stop the competition. Never be glad ahead of time, because then you may find yourself in an awkward situation. But we must admit that the trio from Kemba Walker is really very beautiful. Well, in addition to basketball, he is fond of dancing. After watching such videos, I now dislike all the games that have to do with a ball. The video appears to be a typical high school competition, but the girl clearly outplayed Sniper Elite and now knocks out two people in one blow. Moreover, the guy just went to buy snacks for the match. I hope the victim wears a helmet on her next time. I have never seen a more surrealistic picture. Our godless midfielder, Leonardo Coltris, is injured during the match. So, instead of carefully and professionally taking the player out of the field, the porters take him like a bag of vegetables and throw him on a stretcher first. After that, laughing, they drop him several times. It seems to me that these guys are the fans of another team. That is why they treat the football player so casually. Marcella Kernegi, who was supposed to weigh in before the competitive duel, made the entire hall hold their breath with just one careless movement. Oh my! A little more and she would have become the main discussion of annoying paparazzi. You can even hear her obscene comment. Please show Adidas how to really make a sports uniform. The 2012 Rugby Championship featured the Sharks versus the Storms, and from the first team, a player with a nickname suitable for him, the Beast, kept his comrade above him. The catch is that the guy weighed 112 kilograms, and the Beast was holding him by the edge of his t-shirt. Give him the contacts of weightlifting coaches, because he no longer needs rugby. 
we found a young pickup artist who has been making women happy since his school days. At a baseball game, the young fan skillfully replaces the ball he caught with the ball he bought in the store, and then very confidently turns to the blonde beauty and gives her the bait ball, which shocks her greatly. This guy reminds me of Dean Winchester, who was also a female pleaser. Sometimes athletes forget and stop respecting the hard work of referees who are trying to follow the rules in the games and make them fair. Some are careless with them, and some even cross the line and start yelling at them. And because of such hard work, our referee at the most crucial moment confuses the winner and raises the hand of the wrong girl. Wait, aren't we by chance watching new Porsche models appear? Okay, in fact, this moment may suggest to Vin Diesel the script for the new part of The Fast and the Furious. Which one is it? Number 24? Hopefully, it won't stretch for another 10 parts. And here are the girls competing at the Turkish International Athletics Championship. It includes all disciplines – long jump, running, relay race with sticks, as well as pole vaulting. And when the participants were doing running, one of them twisted her leg, after which she could hardly step on it. But one of the rivals remembers that sport is not only a struggle, but also a support. She immediately ran to the victim and helped her. This is a real sports etiquette. Thank you for another phobia and the sport I will never start doing. A professional jumper Timur Murganov at the IAF Championship in Rabat almost put himself on a pole. He was saved by just a few millimeters, and the pole just made additional ventilation in his pants and the t-shirt. In general, the picture would not be so pleasant. Probably Count Dracula would have liked it. He is kind of a fan of this. In my opinion, they outdid the skill of Morgan Freeman from Bruce Almighty, who ostentatiously walked on water. Now, let him try to walk underwater and even in heels. But seriously speaking, if I had to wear heels in some uncomprehensible situation, I would walk worse on land than girls walk underwater. I bet I would fall after a few steps taken. Hmm, even professionals sometimes run out of patience and they can get handsy. Due to an unfortunate collision, two riders began to fight right in the middle of the racetrack. But in fact, the hit of a driver who lost his bike is pretty fair because the enemy seemed to cut him off on purpose. That's what I understand. Ingenuity in sports is a very useful thing. Mike Bryan threw his racket to hit the ball and get a point at the tennis championship. It's a pity that this is against the rules, because it was very beautiful. I think even the judge himself restrained himself so as not to count the ball, but it would be cooler if the racket could return as well as the hammer Mjolnir to Thor. Let's once and forever remember the name of this crazy guy, Craig Saucier. After his parachute had been saturated with gas, he jumped out of the plane with it, after which he fired a flare and it burned out in a matter of seconds. What was it for? He claimed the award from GoPro. And I thought that this was a new trailer for the movie Mission Impossible, and this is again Tom Cruise trying to impress the audience. Well, watching these videos, of course, I got several new phobias, and especially the phobia of the ball. But it was quite cool to watch the athletes who are completely devoted to their work. Write in the comments what you want to see next time, and don't forget to like and subscribe not to miss a new video that will make you laugh all day long.